Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am the Glam Doctor Mona Khan, and today we are going to talk about a skincare brand called Amoro Vitsa. Let me show you what the logo looks like. So pretty. So I personally found out about Amoro Vitsa about a year and a half ago. Uh, my sister actually is the one who got me into the skincare line because she's always looking for more organic, natural sort of skincare um, brands and makeup brands and that's just kind of her thing. So she introduced me first to Moravitsa. The first um, product that I used was the Thermal Cleansing Balm. So it looks something like this. I don't have the actual product with me because I used it up and didn't keep the jar with me, but it's a jar that's very similar to this except it's black. So it's like a black mud that comes um, from that Hungarian spring in the, in the actual mud that's on the bottom of those springs and it's used as a cleansing balm and let me tell you it is amazing it's so luxurious so you wet the skin and then you apply the cleansing balm all over the face and work it into the skin and instead of just rinsing it off like a normal um, cleanser you have to use a washcloth or a mitt i actually have a the amora vitsa mitt that I use, I warm it up with, I mean, I get it wet with warm water and then I go ahead and I wipe the cleanser off. If you don't do it that way, the cleanser is gonna leave this like um, sh uh, sticky like sort of feeling on your skin and it's not, you're gonna feel, it's gonna, it's, you're not gonna remove the actual product from your face. So this is the only way that you can actually remove the mud. So it's like, and it smells like super expensive, luxurious, mud and it feels so good when you put it on the skin once your skin um once you wipe it off of your skin with the washcloth or the mitt it feels supple sm um, smooth softer your skin with consistent use starts to look more firmer brighter um and i just really enjoy it it's a very wonderful luxurious cleansing balm and the second cleansing product of Amora Vita that I tried is their newest product. This is the Hydra Melting Cleanser. So this is a triphasic cleanser. So it goes from a gel to um, a oil. Then once you get water onto it, it becomes like a milky emulsion. And this is what it looks like. It's like this really pretty turquoise sort of color. Smells really good as well. It's recommended um, to be used to remove your makeup, but I found that it's not very good at removing makeup. I would definitely, well, maybe it's because my makeup is pretty much bulletproof. <laughs> but what I would do is I would remove my makeup with either um, a makeup wipe or however you use your, however you remove your makeup. I usually use coconut oil to remove my makeup and then I go in with this. This actually, you don't need to use a washcloth to rinse it off. It rinses off pretty easily. This will give your skin a brighter, smoother, firmer appearance to your skin. There's a lot of good nutrients in this skin. Let me see real quick, I'll tell you exactly what's in there. So there's a flower extract in there that reduces inflammation. There's vitamins A, E, and C, and omega-3s in there, which help with cell regeneration and help with um, nourishing your skin. So when you are done with this, you will feel like you've been using something that is super luxurious and amazing. The next product that I'm gonna talk about is my favorite cleanser out of the brand, and it is the Cleansing Foam um, Cleanser. It, this is a trial size, so I usually have the bigger one, but I use that one up as well. And I'm trying other products, so right now um, I'm just having the tri uh, trial size because I like to take it to the gym because it removes everything. This will remove all of your makeup, including your waterproof makeup. It has a really nice blue color to it, and it foams really well once you apply water to it smells really good it will leave your skin feeling hydrated it won't strip your skin of any sort of moisture and it's an it's if you really like your squeaky clean type of feeling which is what i personally like a lot too um this one would be the uh, better one for you and it's the most um i think most versatile out of the cleansers so the next thing that i want to talk to you about is a new product another new product that i started using from the amora visa line this is the miracle facial oil I love facial oils. Even though I have normal to oily skin, I have noticed that oils have helped with oil control. So I'm sure you've all 
have read about this now. Um, the myth used to be that if you applied oil to oily skin, your skin's gonna get even more oily. Well, that's just a myth. When you apply oil to your skin and you have oily skin, your skin will tend to regulate itself because there's already oil there. The reason why you're oil is because oily is because your skin thinks that it's uh, dehydrated and dry, so it starts to over overcompensate and produce more oil. So oil actually helps control sebum production. What I like about this oil is it really, really helps in terms of inflammation and any sort of irritation that you may have. A couple months ago, I had a really, really bad sinusitis infection and I went through two boxes of tissues in like a day and the corners of my nose got really raw and red and like painful. So what I started doing is I literally would just apply the oil right to that area and the next morning I woke up and it was back to being normal so much better. It was soft, hydrated, the pain went away, the redness went away, so I really enjoy this particular oil. A couple things that are in this oil are um, evening primrose oil, jojoba oil, and sweet almond oil, and sea buckthorn oil. So they help fade fine lines, improve the texture of your skin, and aid in also cell regeneration, which is great. So this is a very good anti-aging um, product. You can see, even though I've used it for months, I barely have made a dent in the actual product. So it will last you a very long time, and I really love this. So a few other reasons why this oil is so amazing is it does help with elasticity, improving it, it helps with firming, it also um, helps with um, boosting collagen production, it's good for any sort of anti-inflammatory properties, and there are antioxidants in this that will help with fighting environmental damage. So this is pretty much an all-in-one oil and contains the most amazing stuff. It's so soothing, it smells so good, it's easily absorbed into the skin and I highly recommend this. All right guys, so now we're gonna talk about my favorite product out of the entire line, and it is the Copper Peel. This stuff is amazing. So in the blue tube, it's the actual copper that you apply to your skin, kind of like how you would frost a cake, and the clear tube has lactic acid in it, and this is the activator. So they work together synergistically to give you amazing results. The copper gluconate also helps in semen production and helping with detoxifying the skin. The lactic acid helps with rejuvenation, cell turnover, firming, elasticity, and together it's just amazing. Your skin with consistent use will look more luminous, your pores will start, start to shrink, you're, you're gonna wake up and you're just gonna look at your skin and it's gonna be more supple, more, more firm, more plump, and it's just beautiful the way that this product works. And it's so gentle that it could be used on many different types of skin types. And it's even good for my sister's sensitive skin. So, and you can use one tube of this up to four times is what how many how many uses I've been able to get out of it. So these come in a set of eight or 16. So if you were to get the set of eight, you'll end up getting actual, actually 32 uses out of it, which for $85 is pretty good for a luxury spa skincare peel experience. So I love this product. This is another one that I highly recommend. And what I do is I use this at night and after I'm done using this, I apply the Miracle facial oil because I feel like it really helps with any sort of irritation or inflammation that you may have. And these these products together work very well together. However, I, want, I do want to say if you're on Retin-A like I am, I wouldn't use Retin-A the same night that I'm doing the peel. So usually what I do is if I, I do the peel maybe every few weeks, I do four days consistently of the peel. Those four days I don't use Retin-A and then the fifth night when I'm not using this product anymore, I go back to my Retin-A regimen and you should be fine. The next product that I want to talk about is the Deep Cleansing Mask. This is an amazing mask. Now if you want to feel luxury, this is the mask for you. It's rich in calcium and magnesium so it draws out and sucks all the nasty stuff out of your pores and makes your skin firmer and more taut. And what I like about it is in comparison to the Glam Glow, the white one, I feel like this is um, a better option. What I do love about it is what I do is I take a brush, like a foundation brush that I don't use for foundation obviously, <laughs> and I mix it into the product and I paint it onto my face and I just relax on a recliner and it has this like amazing cooling sensation and smells like 
It smells like a spa. It's so good. This is definitely like a luxury product, but at the same time, it also works and is very, very effective. So definitely recommend this one as well. Any of the products from Omura Vita, they're, they're going to be great. If you're looking for things that are not going to have any sort of like chemicals or synthetic materials in there, Amora Vita is a brand for you. Another good thing about Amora Vita is everything is super gentle. So there's not going to be anything in the product line that's going to be um, highly irritating or cause, any, cause you to have a breakout or anything like that. The last product that I want to talk about is the Queen of Hungry Mist. This is the trial size version, so there is a larger version if that's what you're looking for. This was actually the first recorded perfume that Queen Elizabeth of the 14th century um, used. There's neroli and rose in this, and it smells so good. This is really good for during the winter time when the cold weather just sucks the life out of your skin and then you're indoors all the time and having heating on and it just takes all the moisture away from your skin. It's really good for a pick-me-up. It smells divine and yeah, if you're looking for, if you're into facial mist, this is one that you may want to try out. It just smells so good and uh, I think you would really enjoy it. Alright guys, so that's the entire video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so. I would really appreciate it. Check out my blog, glamdoctormonacon.com for more tips and tricks and pics and lots of good stuff. If you need more information on any of the products that I spoke about today, I will definitely include them in the description box down below, including, I'll include some links also so you'll know where to come and where to buy them. If you're interested in the Amora Vita line but you don't want to commit to a full-size product, they do have an introductory set that has the Thermal Cleansing Balm, the Deep Cleansing Mask, the Queen of Hungry Mist, the illuminating moisturizer and i think there may be something else i'm not exactly sure but that's something definitely you want to check out you can find it at nordstrom it's at sephora amoravita.com also um, has all their products of course and another thing is what's good about amoravita is if you email them the contact if you go to their actual website and you email them through to their email address and ask them for certain products that you want to try out they will send you samples all the way from hungary of certain things so you can try them out before you decide or make a commitment to buy them so i hope you enjoy everything if you have any questions please write them down in the comments below or email me i'll see you guys all very soon thank you so much for watching bye